The government is enlisting 13 different departments for research and development in the event of a solar storm that could wipe out the use of modern technology. Experts constantly monitor space weather. High activity from our sun generates powerful solar flares, which are intense bursts of radiation, and can disrupt GPS and communication signals if they reach Earth. But the biggest threats are coronal mass ejections. CMEs are huge eruptions that send out bursts of solar plasma into space at unfathomable amounts of speed. CMEs that hit Earth could spark geomagnetic storms, wiping out power grids and leaving us in the dark. In March 1989, a CME caused a blackout in Quebec. Over six million people were without power for nine hours. But the worst CME that ever occurred was in 1859. Known as the Carrington event, it was three times more powerful than what struck Quebec. It started fires and shortened out telegraph wires in the US and Europe. NASA revealed that the Earth narrowly avoided a Carrington-level CME in 2012. Experts say if it would have struck us, it would have cost over $2 trillion in damages. NASA says there's a 12% chance that the Earth will get struck with an extreme solar storm within the next 10 years.